Hi, I'm Barbara, the co-CEO of 100% Renewables, a consultancy specializing in the development of climate action strategies. In today's video, I'll be talking about target setting in line with science. Science-based targets are greenhouse gas emissions reduction targets that are consistent with the level of decarbonization that is required to keep global temperature increase within 1.5 degrees Celsius compared to pre-industrial temperature levels. Science-based targets are consistent with the long-term goal of reaching net zero emissions in the second half of this century as per the Paris Agreement. SPTs provide a trajectory for companies to reduce their greenhouse gas emissions. The Science-Based Targets Initiative, or SPTI for short, enables you to demonstrate your climate change leadership by publicly committing to science-based greenhouse gas reduction targets. The SPTI is a collaboration between CDP, the United Nations Global Compact, the World Resources Institute and the World Wide Fund for Nature. The overall aim of the initiative is that by 2020 science-based target setting will become standard business practice and corporations will play a major role in ensuring we keep global warming well below a 2 degrees Celsius uh, increase. SBT target setting methods are complex and should be considered in the context of your operations and value chains. Generally, science-based target setting methods have three components. Firstly, a carbon budget, which defines the overall amount of greenhouse gases that can be emitted to limit warming to 1.5 degrees Celsius. Secondly, an emission scenario, which defines the magnitude and the timing of emissions reductions. And thirdly, an allocation approach, which defines how the carbon budget is allocated to individual companies. In my next video, I'll talk about target setting approaches for SBT. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Thanks for watching.